which was one of Shonen's biggest titles when it was serializing alongside series such as Naruto and One Piece, but today it can get a lot of hate by people who have or have not experienced the series. I decided to read through the entirety of Bleach though in order to see which side of the Bleach fence I've fallen in to be caught up for its final season coming out soon. So join me and let's figure out if Bleach is really worthy of its title as one of the big three. And yes, this video's title is referencing Super Eyepatch Wolf's video on Bleach. I wouldn't say his videos are on their opinions and you gotta respect them even if he doesn't think Asin can solo your favorite universe, but I won't try to disprove his points either because they're all valid and I end up agreeing with some of them. But at first is art and goddamn Kubo really does know how to draw. This manga has some gorgeous art and the fact that it was weekly can sometimes be astonishing. I especially love his spreads. They're always so good and do a great job of conveying whatever they're showing whether that be a strong attack, character introduction, or team up. But the art also contributes to one of Bleach's main selling points. It's style. Not its art style per se but more just so how Bleach feels and it feels really damn cool. This can be shown through creative uses of revealing the chapter's title or in the character's outfits. You can't have awesome outfits without characters though, and Bleach's characters are honestly pretty good. Of course you've got the obvious goat choice of Aizen, but Bleach's side and main characters can hold their own as well. Throughout the series, we'll see the main side characters like Chad, or Hime, and Rukia, but the other side characters, especially from the 13 Quark Guard companies, are great as well. Some of my favorites are Renji, Kenpachi, Kaku, Hitsugaya, Yoruichi, and Kiraku. And the antagonists like Okiora and Tsukushima are great as well. But we gotta talk about the main character, Ichigo, and he fits Bleach well and is a pretty good protagonist. There may be a little problem here and there though, how he gets incredibly strong over short training sequence, but I don't really care. What I feel makes Ichigo Ichigo though are the side characters. Sure, Ichigo is the main character, but I don't think he'd be who he is if it wasn't for side characters like Rukia or Chad. Take that as you will, but I think he's a pretty good protagonist because of himself and the others around him. But the characters of Bleach are all great. They're nothing outstanding that'll make you write a 40 page Twitter thread on them, but they're still pretty good. The story of Bleach is about the same though. It was nothing outstanding, but still pretty entertaining. The two standout arcs for me so far have been the Soul Society and Aaron Carr arcs. Both are great with Soul Society exploring more of Bleach's world and giving us some great new characters and with Aaron Carr giving us some of the best fights in the series and some even better villains. But I think Bleach gets better with each major arc. What I mean is that in simple terms, Soul Society is not the best arc in my opinion. It's still a great ass arc and I loved it, I just think Aaron Carr was a bit better. Which is honestly a good thing because I was worried going into Bleach that Soul Society would be the best arc and that the series would peak not even a third of the way through based off what I heard about this series. But back to the story. It is really good, it can fumble here and there and it isn't perfect, but it is still strong. It won't astound you to the point you'll swear up and down that it shits on anything written since 1654, but it will entertain you and just be a good story, and to be honest, that's all it needs to do. I loved reading Bleach. It was actually really good, and I was really pleasantly surprised because I heard a bunch of bad things about this series going in. I think there is a major problem in this community, though, where we judge something before we even experience it at least a little bit, because a lot of the things I heard about Bleach that weren't so great were coming from people who have never even read or watched this series. Now, if you did try to read slash watch Bleach and didn't like it, that is perfectly okay. You're allowed to dislike something, and at least you tried to like it. I'll get more into this at a later point in another video maybe, but basically what I'm trying to say is if you haven't already, try giving Bleach a chance. It might just surprise you. But overall, Bleach is just pure unbridled shonen that is just fun and hype and definitely earns its spot as one of the big three right alongside Naruto and One Piece. I still have One Piece above it, that's just me though. I've never read Naruto, so I can't say anything about that. Right now though, I'd have it at an 8 out of 10, but that may change when I catch up with the Thousand Year Blood War arc and the new special anniversary chapter coming out, which I'm really excited for. I can't wait to see the series back. But if you haven't read Bleach, I say go ahead and pick it up. You got nothing to lose, and I guarantee you'll have a good time with this series with its great characters, interesting story, and some of Shonen's most amazing and satisfying fights. Now, I do think the manga is the best way to experience this series, but you can watch the anime as well. Now, I want to be selfish and move on from Bleach for a second and talk about me. So, school's starting back up here soon, and I probably won't be able to put out as much videos as I could. I'm not gonna lie, I'm also playing through Dragon Quest and Metroid, so that may play a little part in it as well. I will probably make videos on those though, so look forward to that. Anyways, I just want to say thank you for the support on these past few videos I've made. Every little view and subscriber makes me feel happy and makes me want to do more. So seriously, thank you for everything. Anyways, check out Bleach and I'll see you all when I can.